In this video we see another note. The footage for this one is a lot shorter and it's even more distorted than the last one. But if you haven't checked out the last one, check it out now because I'm starting to find a lot of these known videos and it's quite interesting because it's not something you'd expect to find loads of hoaxes about. But let's explore this one. So the guy appears to be on a street, he's recording, it's very fuzzy, it's very blurry, it looks to be late at night, and next to a lamppost is a small creature with a pointy hat. So I know that was difficult to see, and once again that makes it harder to debunk. I guess you could say that he was nervous, or she, but it instantly raises suspicions for me. Now this gnome is larger than the other one almost to the point where it could be a very small person, possibly someone with dwarfism. There is also a theory that I think is quite interesting, and after reviewing it makes some sort of sense, that all these gnome sightings, including this one, are actually anteater sightings. When an anteater gets scared, it rears up on its hind legs, and it runs. And obviously, anteaters have a pointy snout, and when it's on its hind legs, that snout is in the air, so it looks almost like a hat. So it gives it this gnome-like appearance. Do you think it's real? Do you think gnomes are real in general? Do you want me to do more of these videos? If it gets 50 likes, I'll do another one. As I said, there's plenty out there. Share it with a friend, like it if you did, and of course, if you haven't already, subscribe for more creepy content.